This is a demo of an AR-enabled Babylon React Native application running on top of both iOS and Android, as well as an example of the transportability of code between Babylon Native and Babylon JS web-based applications. The first thing you're going to see here on the right is the app running on top of iOS. This is a standard AR placement experience where you can place a model, move it around, and view it in the context of your environment. The interesting part about this is that all of the code driving the 3D experience is written in TypeScript and running on top of React Native's JavaScript engine. This means you can have the exact same code drive the AR experience for both iOS and Android, and you can also take advantage of React Native's development tools. So if I go over here to the left and change the code to swap out which model should be loaded, you'll see the change pushed to both iOS and Android applications simultaneously via fast refresh. Now if I enter into the AR placement experience on Android, you'll see it looks and feels pretty much the same as what we saw in iOS. Another advantage here is that since all of this code is written against the Babylon.js APIs, all of the code driving the 3D experience can be directly copied into a Babylon.js web application and run with no code changes. Now we have the exact same 3D scene running on our web app as we do in our two native apps. If we save this down and open it in an XR supported browser such as Chrome on Android, we can actually see the exact same AR placement experience that we saw in our native apps in the context of our web application with no download required. I hope this demo gave you a good idea for the transportability and scalability of code written for Babylon React Native and Babylon JS.